Hello everyone, welcome to Static GK quiz number 135. This video is aimed to help you with your central and state government job examinations. I'm Ritrisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. Lord Jagannath is related to which of the following places? The correct answer is Puri. The Sri Jagannath Temple of Puri is an important Hindu temple dedicated to Lord Jagannath, a form of Lord Mahavishnu, located on the eastern coast of India at Puri in the state of Orissa. Which among the following sites gives an evidence of maritime trade in Harappan era? The correct answer is Lothal. Lothal is one of the southernmost cities of the ancient Indus Valley civilization and it is currently located in the Bhal region of modern state of Gujarat. There is evidence that it was first inhabited in 3700 BCE. Lothal's rivers provide direct access to sea route. Although now sealed off from the sea, Lothal's topography and geology reflects its maritime past. Fahin, who came to India during Gupta period, had the main motive of what? The correct answer is the study of teachings of Buddha. So, uh, Fahin was a Chinese Buddhist monk and a translator who traveled by foot from ancient China to ancient India, visiting many sacred Buddhist sites in Central Asia, the Indian subcontinent and Southeast Asia between 399 and 412 CE to acquire Buddhist texts. Which among the following is the best example of Vijayanagar art? The correct answer is Hampi. Hampi is built according to Vijayanagar architecture, uh, which is uh, of the 1336 to 1565 CE, and it was a notable building idiom that developed during the rule of Imperial Hindu Vijayanagar Empire. Earlier in the centuries, when these empires ruled, it is characterized by a return to the simplistic and serene art of the past. On February 20th, 1947, the British government declared its intention to quit India by when? The correct answer is June of 1948. The Prime Minister of United Kingdom then announced on 20th February 1947 that the British government will grant full self-government to British India by 30th June 1948 at the latest. The future of the princely states would be decided after the date of final transfer is decided. By which Charter Act financial allocation for education was made for the first time? The correct answer is Charter Act of 1813. The East India Company Act of 1813, which is also known as the Charter Act 1813, was an act of the Parliament of the United Kingdom, which renewed the charter issued to the British East India Company and continued the company's rule in India. However, the company's commercial monopoly was ended, except for the tea and opium trade and the trade with China, this reflecting the growth of British Crown's power in India. Lord Wayville was the Viceroy of India at which of the following events? The correct answer is Cabinet Mission Plan. So the Cabinet Mission Plan of 1946 came to India, aimed to discuss the transfer of power from the British government to the Indian leadership, with the aim of preserving India's unity and giving it independence. Lord Wayville, the Viceroy of India, did not participate in every step, but he was present. First round table conference was held during November 1930, January 1931, between this time period. Who was the Viceroy of India at that time? The correct answer is Lord Irwin. In response to the inadequacy of the Simon Report, the Labour government, which had come to power under Ramsay MacDonald in 1929, decided to hold a series of round table conferences in London. The first round table Conference convened from 12th November 1930 to 19 January 1931. Which among the following was a unit of Mughal Empire for the purpose of administration and revenue collection? The correct answer is Subhas. A Subha was the term for a province in the Mughal Empire. The word is derived from the Arabic and Persian. The governor or ruler of the Subha was known as the Subadar, which later became Subedar to refer to a ranking officer in an army. Out of capital of Akbar's kingdom, Bulan Darwaza, Panch Mahal and Akbar's mausoleum, which are located at the same place. The correct answer is capital of Akbar's kingdom, Bulan Darwaza and Panch Mahal. Capital of Akbar's kingdom, Bulan Darwaza and Panch Mahal, all of these are located at uh, Fatehpur, Sikri, 
whereas the mausoleum of Akbar is located in Sikandra. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.